modern market offers dozens of different additives for engine oils. Most manufacturers promise the same thing. For example, increasing of compression, engine power, or reducing the consumption of fuel and oil. Many of oil additives contain ultra-dispersed powder. In general, it contains metal powders, and such products refer to metal restorers or remetallizers. Also, there are other types of oil additives which contain ceramic or mineral powder. They are called geomodifiers. Some manufacturers of so-called intelligent or smart additives claim that the engine may run without any oil at all after treatment with one of their products. It seems like uh, when you damage a grain case and then you are going to a long tree. Today we will check this myth. Can the engine run without any oil, even after application of special additives? For this experiment, we won't use a real engine. It is too risky. We won't conduct this experiment on the engine stand, because the interpretation of the result will be quite difficult. Instead of that, we are going to model this experiment on a modern friction machine in the laboratory of the VMP Auto Company. Using structural and energy principle of modeling, we will simulate a work of upper compression ring. This ring works in the engine in extreme conditions and under very high temperature. The temperature can reach 200-220 degrees during the proper work of the petrol engine. So we will simulate these conditions. We have following materials for this test. Chrome pad from real compression ring, cast iron roller and synthetic Synthetic Oil Shell Helix Plus 10W40. We will conduct three different experiments. In the beginning, like in a real engine, we conduct a running in of friction pair with pure oil. Then, we will reach working temperature of 200-220 degrees in friction zone. In the first experiment, we will stop oil supply and see what happens with frictional moment and temperature. In the second experiment, we will apply a geomodifier to friction pair. And in the third experiment, we will use engine restorer resource. After that, we will again stop oil supply and estimate the duration of friction pair work comparing to work on pure oil. So, we begin running in. For running in, it took 35 minutes. The temperature in friction pair reached the working temperature, and it is 215 degrees. Now we stop oil supply and start counting the time. We can see a significant increase of frictional moment and the temperature. In other words, the tear occurred after 4 minutes 40. Here you can see what happens with the piston ring after tear. The friction surface is destroyed completely. The ring won't work and the engine will be almost destroyed. Let's take new samples for testing, and after running in, we will add geomodifier in the amount recommended by the manufacturer. After 10 minutes of treatment with the geomodifier, we will stop oil supply and wait when the tear appears. As you can see, on the friction pair treated with the geomodifier, the tear occurred after 8 minutes 30. Using the same method, we will test engine restorer resource. After 35 minutes of running in, we will change oil to the oil with resource.
pay attention on the fact that after resource application, the temperature and the frictional moment decreased immediately. The temperature dropped from 222 to 170 and the frictional moment from 0.68 newton meter to 0.36. After 10 minutes of work, we stop supply of oil with the resource and count the time until tear occurs. So after 25 minutes, when we stop supply of the oil with the resource, we can see the stable work of friction bear. The temperature is still 170 degrees and the frictional moment is 0.4 newton meter. How we can hear the tear begins. There is lots of smoke. Here it is. Only 35 minutes after the beginning of the test, the tear occurred. As you can see, the working time of the friction pair treated with the resource has been working during 34 minutes after stop of oil supply. In these experiments, we simulated engine work without any oil. We simulated work of upper piston ring because this ring works in the most extreme conditions. Now let's see the results of the tests. After the running in on pure oil and stop of oil supply, the unit worked during 4 minutes 40. After the treatment with the geomodifier, the working time of the unit was 8 minutes 30. The same test with the engine restorer resource showed the result of 34 minutes. All these tests were conducted under the normal conditions of the car engine. However, before we carried out other tests, for example, we simulated idle work when the engine has been working more than 250 minutes without any oil and additives. On the other hand, when the engine works in extreme conditions and the temperature in the upper ring can reach 260 to 180 degrees, we have different results. After stopping of foil supply, the friction pair was working only for 10 seconds. After application of gel modifier, it was working for 20 seconds. And after treatment with the engine restorer resource, the friction pair was working for 7 minutes. What conclusion can we do? After these experiments, it is impossible to provide a long-term work of the engine without any oil. However, if you apply engine restorer resource to your engine, you can drive to the nearest service station, for example, in case of damaged crankcase.